This is Professor Vittle Randowski. I'm making this video upload on August 8th. First, you, my darling. This is the last you'll see or hear from me. I, I will probably not be alive for more than the next few minutes. Sell all of my patents, all of my awards, and even money. I'm just. Gonna... What we had feared most is going to happen, and soon. It's an unexpected anomaly that the others have conspired to keep secret for as long as possible. But the truth is that Neptune, Uranus, Saturn, and Jupiter have all shifted their rotational patterns. Each planet's rotation is now synchronized with the Sun. Mars is following suit. Earth will be doing the same within eight years' time. We believe that Earth will be tidally locked to the Sun within the next 30 years. don't understand why yet. It's as if the solar system is shifting into a completely new order. The Earth will have one light side permanently facing the sun, and the other side will be in perpetual darkness. Just as our moon now has a light and a dark side, temperature differences between the two sides, 100 degrees centigrade on the light side, negative 80 degrees centigrade on the dark side. Eventually, the light side will become nothing but dust and sand, and the dark side will become covered in ice. But there's still hope for life. And, that, and that's why they want to keep it a secret and drop it from it. reason they want to keep it a secret is because of the golden zone, a band around the earth which will remain in a kind of eternal twilight where the temperature will be habitable and agriculture will still be possible. The biggest <coughs> danger there will be from the frequent storms caused by the temperature differences between the light and the dark side. But life will be able to adapt. People will be able to survive there after several <laughs> decades. This is the golden zone. It would be from about 150 to 300 kilometers wide. And its, and, and its center will most likely be through the 21st meridian east and the 159th meridian west. <laughs> there are others here at the research center who want to sell this information to the corporations and the rich. It's madness. Scientists are the servants of the people. People need and have to know the truth. <coughs> Life can go on. You just have to start preparing now. Time is essential. <coughs> I'm sure <coughs> this video is sure to create a lot of disturbance in the coming weeks. But other scientists will now be coming up with more information about what to do and how to survive on, on Earth afterwards. <coughs> and no matter what, science must remain free. Stay strong. Love and help each other. That's the only way forward.